Honey, this is nuts. I don't mind giving my statement to Sam about my whereabouts tonight of Julian's murder, but why would he want one from you? Oh, honey, it's just a formality. It's like Sam said, they need an affidavit from everyone who could be a suspect. Which counts you out. You, you barely knew Julian. Honey, your name wouldn't be on the list if it wasn't for me. This is all my fault. Oh, honey, now stop it. Really, it's not a big deal. No? <laughs> Baby, you have barely said a word to me all night. Now, if it's not about the murder case, then what is it? I'm worried about those DNA test results coming back, because I think it is going to kill Grace to find out that John isn't really her son. You say that like you believe it. Since when? Eve, when did you start believing that I was right about John not being Grace's son? Well, I can't pinpoint the exact well, day. It's not like I want it to be true. I mean, I know how much it's going to hurt Grace. I just wish I never said anything. I'm pretty sure it wouldn't have changed anything. Yeah, you're probably right. But Rebecca seems more convinced than I am that David is working for Ivy. And when you think about it, it all tracks. I mean, this whole first husband story is just another ploy by Ivy to try to bring trouble to Sam and Grace. Do the Cranes ever give up? I don't think so. When would the DNA test be in? Oh, any time now. That's good. One way or another, this whole dirty mess is going to be out in the open. Only TC. Those DNA tests have got to be altered. Everyone has to believe that John is Grace's son. I won't do it, Ivy. I'm not going to do anything to hurt Sam and Grace. <sighs> well, how noble of you, Eve. Unfortunately, you have no choice. You can't force me. Oh. Need I remind you of what I can do to you if you refuse? I will tell TC all about your sordid affair with Julian. About the baby you had with Julian. The baby that died. Most likely because of your drug use. Dr. Russell. <sighs> Ivy. Well, I don't care what you tell TC. I am not going to tamper with that DNA evidence. I don't care what you do to me. Help me be strong. Sweetheart, what's wrong? Who are you arguing with? Oh, it's just one of my patients from the hospital. But Eve, you seem upset. Well, she's... She's very difficult, and she doesn't take anyone's advice. <laughs> well, what about? She's keeping something important from her husband. Well, she's got herself the right doctor. And I'm sure you told her whatever it is, she has to be honest with her husband. Because that's what marriage is built on. Trust and honesty. Yeah. Honey, enough about everyone else. Even if they are your patients. You need to concentrate on yourself. You seem so sad lately. Do I? Baby, you're acting like you lost your best friend. And trust me, you have it. Now, I happen to know the guy, and he is head over heels in love with you as much as he was on the day that he married you. I love you, TC. No matter whatever happens, just always remember how much I love you. And I love you, too. I do not buy the girl's story about having a pillow fight. Oh, come on. I need her cousins. Whatever else is going on, I believe Charity. They wouldn't hurt each other. Huh. Hey. Come on in. Uh, we can't stay long. Yeah, um, we fought over these statements that you wanted. I still can't believe you consider Eva suspect in Julian's murder. Take it easy, honey. 
Sam's just doing his job. Well, do you have enough time to stay for a beer? Yeah. So, how you doing, Eve? Uh, can't you tell, Grace? I'm about to explode from all the secrets I'm keeping from my husband. The secret about Julian. I think I'm going to tell him, Grace. I think I'm going to tell T.C. everything. Well, that's quite a switch for you, Eve. I mean, you've been so adamant about him not knowing. Oh, he's going to find out anyway. Well, how? I mean, how would he find out? Julian's dead. I'm not going to tell him. How else would he find out? What are you keeping from me, Eve? <sighs> you just... You never know when the past is... It's going to come around and bite you. You know what? I think you worry too much. Just take off your coat. Relax. I'll fix this a snack. Hey. Okay? Oh, if only it were that simple, Grace. Yes. Didn't I tell you to leave me alone? No, oh, forget it. I am not going to lie and deceive my best friend anymore. Grace is far too decent a person for that. Now just leave me alone. The hospital? Yes, that was the hospital, and they said they're not going to be able to get the results to us till tomorrow morning. Good <sighs> morning. You know, I've already waited long enough to prove I'm right about John being my son. What's wrong, huh? I just told Grace <sighs> that the hospital won't have the results for us till tomorrow morning. But can't you just call them back and tell them you need the results tonight? 